Mario! Hello! Hello, everybody, and welcome to Let's Play Super Mario 64. Let's get this thing started. No. Okay. So I did a practice run, I didn't get all the stars, but I am pretty familiar with all the controls, but shh. Dear Mario, please come to the castle. I have baked a cake for you. Yours truly, Princess Toadstool. Peach. The cake is a lie! The cake is a lie before the even the meme for the cake is a lie came out. Seriously. She's a bitch. Huh. Anyways. This is Princess Beach's castle, where we will spend the majority of the game collecting what is called Power Stars. And what the fuck are Power Stars? But they're magical stars that apparently have some significance in this world. Seriously, they never really explain what the fuck they do with them. It's only really explained in Super Mario Galaxy. It's a power source. That's it. Yep. And now we can begin the game. Not much to do here. I mean, you can go around the whole entire courtyard and actually look at these signs, and they just tell you tutorials and shit. But, I mean, I'm already familiar enough with the controls I can do almost everything. So, I don't really have to worry about much. So, let's just go... Eh. Hello, Lakitu. Yeah, 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 I don't care. Basically, he's just saying he can. you can adjust the camera angles... And look around. Basically, that's what the key to is for. That's about it. Let's enter the castle. Yeah, that was Bowser. He's just like, my house. Bitch, we're gonna take you out of this house because it's Peach's house. That dumb, ditzy bimbo. Anyways, here's the first level. Bombo bomb Battlefield. No, I mispronounced that. Yeah, 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 don't care. So, our objective in this place is to collect the power stars. And by doing that, we can eventually get the first Bowser, and all is good. And you gotta watch out for that chain chomp. Huh. But I mean, this game is hilarious. Wait, hilarious. I mean, I mean, fun. I mean, shut up. I know what I said. <laughs> uh, this game is from my childhood, and I love it. That's why I'm playing it. And as always, I like to play classic video games, because they're a lot more fun to play than some of the newer games nowadays. Oh! Hi there. And our first objective is get to the top of this place. Secret portal. And then go herp. Hello. Okay, battle. Let's go. Battle. Uh, battle time. Uh, let's go. Hi. And throw. You can't defeat me. Oh, you gotta love these N64 graphics. Them and they're all 64-bit retardedness. Come here. Yeah. Oh, God. No, I didn't mean you to do that. Oh. Fuck. You don't take damage from that, but it's still... His objective is to throw you off this area so his animation can reset and he can... ...not battle you again. Eh. What the? Mario, stop jumping! Okay. Stand still. Grab. Grab! There we go. Okay, one more hit. Yeah, most bosses in the Super Mario 64 games only have about three hits. Unlike future Mario games that have multiple hits, this one only has three. Three seems to be the magic number. Come on. There we go. And toss. Give me a power star. Eh, whatever. And get ready to hear that sound a lot, because a lot of enemies that are bosses in this game have that damn death animation cry, which is very awkward. Yay! The first power star. Eh, it, yeah, whatever. Don't care. So, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be collecting all of the main stars in the level. I won't be collecting the 100 coin stars until later on, after I beat all the levels. Just so you don't get bored. Alright, let's go! Race time!
Let's go! Oh god. Chain chomp. Ah. Oh god. <laughs> ah! Crap. Never mind, let's go this way. Ah! Balls! Balls of doom! Oh! Hi there. Oh, God, why? Oh, this is gonna end badly. Must concentrate! Ow. And somehow I still won. That's right, Mario. Hump that pole. Yeah! Victory hump! Yay! No, I'm just gonna hang out here. Hi. Nah, I'm not really fast. I just cheat. Did that thing come out of his ass? Much like many things in Nintendo games. Shit comes out of their ass. I'm looking at you, Zelda games. Why can Link pull shit out of his ass? That question will never be answered. Anyways, continuing on! Okay. Shoot to the island in the sky. So, earlier, if you were paying attention, which I wasn't, I didn't really care, there's a battle going on with some people on the mountain over there. The pink bombos versus the black bombos. It's Crips in the Bloods here, people. Crips in the Bloods. They got territorial battles. Anyways, they had a cannon up and they were just shooting those weird blue whatever the hell those things were. But, if you talk to him, he'll now let you use the cannons. Now, this is a thing that will happen throughout the entire game. In most levels, you will find a pink bomo, and you will need to find the secret location where they're at in order to activate the secret cannons, in order to get some certain stars. But that will be harder as we continue through the game. Okay, so our objective is to get over to this island that's floating in the air. But this damn thing, I swear to god, it's so tweaky, so you have to be careful. And I overshot it. Damn it. Good job, Mario. Okay. Let's try this again. But from a cannon that's on a more even level with the island. Okay. And about there. No. Okay, thank you. I didn't want to fall off. What are you doing? Don't be retarded. And with that, we get the next star. Hooray! Star power. Let's go. All right. Three coins. High score. Yeah, I don't care. It, basically, that message is just saying, Oh, hey, let's go to this area now that it's open. Nah, fuck that. Okay. So next up is red corn collected. Now this will happen in every single level. This basically sets the standard of the game. The stand this is the basic tutorial level, and it will have coins, it will have crazy shit. It's gonna be just crazy as hell. Wait, wait. how the hell do I describe it? It's gonna it's gonna have a lot of crazy shit. It's gonna be crazy as hell. That sounded retarded. Okay, whatever. <laughs> Anyways, some of these red coins are very dangerous. Like this one over here. Like this one. Okay, gotta watch out. Come on. There we go. Yeah, I hate the chain chomps. The chain chomps are... Ugh. They're a bad enemy, but there's not too many throughout this entire game, luckily enough. So we don't have to worry about that, thankfully. Later on, though, uh, I hate the chain chomps. Okay, where is it? Yeah, there it is. Okay. 
Whew. Some of these red coins in later levels are just going to be pains in the ass to get. Now, some are easier than others, and others are just... Yeah... Hate it. Seriously hate it. Come on, Mario, you can do it! Run, 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 run! Yeah! Awesome. Okay, keep running. So, how's everybody doing? So far, this Let's Play is kind of... I don't know, stupid... Yeah, oh god! I didn't mean to do that. Ah! Stop scaring me! Things are evil. Stop it. I don't like it when you scare me. I don't appreciate it. Anyways! Ah. Last one is over on the floating island again. Okay. Aim. Okay. Grab the tree. Grab the tree. Yeah! Awesome. Whew. Okay. Okay. Mario? Alright. That way! Hit the wall. Yeah, awesome. And we got a star. Da -da -da -da. Okay, so the next star in the subway you can't get yet. You have to get at least 13 stars. Actually, I don't remember the exact amount, but you need a set number of stars in order to get this next one. But the, the one after it actually can be accessed at all times during the game. Well, all times during the level. Now, I like the, the one part about this game that I really like is its open-endedness. And by that, I mean you don't have to be on the same set path to get every single star. Oh, God, it's going to kill me. Yeah, you have to be careful. Oh, God. Mario, run! Huh. You're free! Now, gallop around and... Hurry up and open that gate, dumbass. Yay! Woohoo! We've done it! Woo! Good job! Ah, behind the game shop's gate. Woo! Hey, oh, I didn't say. Whatever. Doesn't matter! Because we have still have a bunch of shit to do. Okay, so the next area... Now... There's going to be these star doors, basically, and they're going to be scattered about the castle. Well, mostly on the first floor. The first one I want to do is over here. Okay. Now you're wondering, well, this is just, it's just a room. There's nothing in it. Well, there's a secret. Secrets. They're everywhere. Go, Mario, go! Slide! Slide, you fat-ass plumber! Slide! So, basically, the objective of this is to make it down to the end of the slide. And do it in the fastest amount of time. So, come on, Mario, you fat-ass! Slide! Slide like you haven't slid in before! Damn it. I didn't get the star. I'm gonna have to come back and do that one again. Now, there's two stars in this particular area. The first one you get is that one. That's the general normal one that everybody gets. Now, yes, save and continue. Now, the second one, on the other hand, is actually a little bit harder to do. Basically, what you gotta do is you gotta get down to the bottom of the slide in the fastest amount of time. And this takes a little bit more practice, but if you're able to pull it off, you will get the second star, which is for beating a wrecker. Mario, you fat ass, keep going! Faster! Faster! Come on! Got it! There we go! Alright, cool. 